Thanks so much for joining us tonight. I'm Bennett Haberly. Tonight, investigators are trying to figure out who shot and killed two men who were discovered in Galloway almost 24 hours ago. The Franklin County Sheriff's Office tells us they aren't exactly sure where the men were shot initially. Attend TV's Richard Solomon has been working this story all day to learn more about what happened. Richard has more from a neighbor on what she witnessed. Earlier this afternoon, the Franklin County Sheriff's Office told me they're still trying to figure out what exactly led up to this shooting. One woman I spoke with who lives on this street says it all happened just a door down from her. Lynn Ann Newsom has lived in this Galloway neighborhood for the last six years, but her sense of safety and security shifted after the Franklin County Sheriff's Office found two men dead in her neighborhood Friday night. It, it makes it not as enjoyable to live here and not as comforting that it's a, you know, a nice neighborhood like we were thinking. The sheriff's office says the two men were found fatally shot on the 300 block of Idlebrook Place. Newsom says she believes she heard gunshots. If I had uh, a sheriff knock on the door um, saying that there was an incident and a shooting, I've got a toddler and then I have another one on the way and it's not something that we want to think is happening literally next door, pretty much. The sheriff's office has not yet said where exactly the shooting itself happened. They did say, however, the two men are believed to be in their late teens, early 20s. Newsom says this gives her reservations. Definitely second thoughts about how the neighborhood is going. The sheriff's office says no arrests have been made and they have no information on a suspect at this time. For now, reporting in Galloway, I'm 10TV's Richard Solomon. Back to you.